Yo, what's good, fam? Thanks for tapping in. Y'all know I keep my finger on the pulse. And let me tell you, things are heating up in North Carolina. We're talking political firestorm scandals and enough drama to make your head spin. Buckle up because this is going to be a wild ride. Mark Robinson, the firebrand Republican running for governor, is smack dab in the middle of it all. Seems like every time this brother turns around, there's another controversy waiting for him. But this time, this time, it's different. This time, it's personal. CNN dropped a bombshell, leaked comment, an adult website. Robinson's alleged words from years ago are raising eyebrows all over the state. We talking about inflammatory stuff here, folks. Talk about slavery. Talk about things that make you question everything you thought you knew. Robinson ain't backing down. He's calling it fake news. A smear campaign to derail his campaign. He's pointing fingers at his Democratic opponent, Josh Stein, claiming dirty politics are at play. The question is, who are you going to believe? This ain't just a local squabble. This thing's got national implications. Republicans are divided. Some are rallying behind Robinson, raising his defiance. Others are calling for him to drop out, worried the scandal will hurt their chances in the upcoming election. Meanwhile, Democrats are smelling blood in the water. They're using this scandal to paint Robinson as too extreme, too dangerous for office. They're hoping to sway undecided voters and flip the governor's mansion blue. One thing's for sure, North Carolina is a battleground state, and this scandal is turning up the heat. Section 4, Trump in the crosshairs. Will this hurt his chances? Here's where it gets really interesting. Robinson is a Trump loyalist, a proud supporter of the MAGA agenda. This scandal has the potential to hurt Trump's chances in 2024, especially among moderate voters who are already wary of the former president. If Robinson goes down, it could be seen as a referendum on Trumpism. It could embolden Democrats and energize their base. On the other hand, if Robinson weathers the storm and wins the governorship, it could give Trump a much needed victory and solidify his grip on the Republican Party. The stakes are high, folks. This is about more than just one man's political career. This is about the future of American democracy. Section five, the stakes, Robinson's gamble and the future of North Carolina. Robinson is a gamble, y'all. He's a wild card. He says what he thinks, even if it makes people uncomfortable. His supporters love him for it. His detractors despise him for it. But one thing's for sure, he's, he's into something real. He's speaking to the anger and frustration of a lot of folks who feel like they've been left behind. Will his gamble pay off? Only time will tell. But one thing's for sure, the political landscape of North Carolina and maybe even America will never be the same. What y'all think? Hit me up in the comments. And don't forget to like, share, and subscribe.